Africa. Uh, it's a very, very hot day today. Uh, for many of you that are just joining for the first time, the land I'm speaking from are uh, totally landlocked. I am speaking from a land that is landlocked. In other words, they have no access to waterways for the transportation of goods and services. But they are doing excellently well. One of the best country in the whole world. A very hidden country. A very tiny country of not less than 9, nine million in population. These 9 million we are talking about included the foreigners. They are doing excellently well. One of the cleanest cities in the whole world. Go and check it. One of the cleanest. One of the countries that have the best transportation system in the whole world. They are not, they don't have access to water. So, pay to do it here. Um, you are welcome, like I, many of you. Uh, we are going to start by um, reminding us that um, without Mazen Nam we will not be talking about today about our freedom. And at the same time, to signify those that are laughing, those that are working against him, both within and outside, that the voice of the man you want to shut up can never. You may hold the man himself, but his message is everywhere, spreading unlike before. And that is the reason why I always want to play um, his voice before I start. But the voice I'm going to play also signifies what I have today in the program. We are going to look into the monarch. <laughs> we are going to look into the monarch, the hungry charlatan, the old cargoes in Biafra land who are claiming to be monarch. Hunger is the root of all evil. Agro can make like agro, agro, hunger will make you like this. You 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 begin to deny your best. In fact, you you denounce your family. Hunger, just like Ojos or Kali have gathered them and begin to share them around. Hunger is a very deadly disease. It's a disease, and with hunger, that is why. They are beginning to succeed in so many attacks they are having on us. But we are also repelling the attack. Few of us that have been bought over in this struggle is because of hunger. The old charlatans who are calling themselves monarchs, <laughs> they don't know what is monarch. And they are working with the criminals in Finland, with the, with the, with the women, the bumbling, dirty women we have in America who are claiming to be mad. Um, one, you need to take care of the administration. You now become a mother overnight. And that's why we are going to look into. We are going to let me start by. Let us start by praying that brokers. Um, uh, it's all about um those who claiming to be monarch in the Afra land. <laughs> they don't know, They don't even know what is monarch. You will see uh, IPOB monarch. <laughs> Oh, to uh, the brothers. Uh, let's go, let's go. And at the same time, we are going to look into the killing that is going on our land, especially in Anahaka. Our women, our children, our brothers and our sisters have been whisked away. It's part of what we have seen. It's part of the reason why we came. So for many of you that are seeing it for the first time, I know it's new to many of you. It depends whether new or old. But this is the reason why we started this journey because we can't keep quiet. If not because of IPOB, who know that people are being killed? You don't know. If not because of the awareness we are creating, connecting one another with YouTube or with Facebook, all sort of available means necessary. You won't know what is going on. You will not even know that your brother has been kidnapped, killed. But because of the awareness we have created, that's why you begin to talk about uh, you have uh, somebody military killing our people. It is not today they started killing our people. So we are going to look into that and at the same time we are going to look into the emirate the the bumbling boko haram himself we have in our land called asari dokobo we are going to see the implication of what he's doing what he's doing is what i call maga maga intimidation working with the nigeria government but they never knew that what is piloting many of us is ideology. It's not by money. How do you mean it's money? We'll go and rest. It's ideology. And ideology, our ideology have never yet put it into practice. When it will subject into practice. Um, I want to get it 
Nobody will quench it. You got no one day like this, one family agraria. People will begin to go into suicide mission because Adnan has too frustrated. Now they are crying, crying, and hey, killing is going on here and there. And that is the reason why they have the impetus coming our land. And um, our political leaders are not speaking because it's none of their business. Both those that are contesting to become your leaders and those that have no intention to contest, they keep quiet. Nothing will happen. Now, lastly, we are going to look into one madman in Germany. With the stack illiterate called princess, a stack bumbling illiterate, which is the husband. This struggle is bigger than them. This struggle, we can't allow this struggle to be converted into a family affair. Because the leader of indigenous people of Biafra never meant it in that way to see it as a family affair. But because of his absence, so they want to make it look like a family affair so that many of you who don't know the game they are playing, you will be demoralized. You will look at and say, it's like these people, they want to use this thing as a family affair. You never knew that the man that started this struggle never wanted to convert it as a family affair, but they entered. Criminals. And if you know you are the homo thing, boy, you come out. Can I hold you clearly? Now let's go. Um, let's go to the voice. I think I have it here. Um, uh, okay. Um, no, let me show you the, the charlatans first. <laughs> let me show you the charlatans. Uh, we are going to take it gradually, brothers. Uh, his voice of Mazen Nam the Kano, but we're going to take it from here. I want to bring, um, I want to advise many of you who are threatening that you will resign on your own. <laughs> we, will die, we will die here. Uh, unless you don't know the reason why you joined this struggle. It's an ideology. It's not uh, something by just willingly. Before you end, before I enter this struggle, I've convinced myself. So that is why no Jupiter, no, nothing will make me, the only time I will resign is when I am dead. I tell you. Instead, we come out. You know the reason why you you feeling ashamed. You don't want to because you don't want to confront people involved. Anybody today, tomorrow, even if like be in the leadership of this struggle and you are working against the ethics of this struggle, your name will be mentioned. Now watch. Look at them here on the screen. Old man, how? How I grow? How I grow, brothers? Look at her How? Let's listen to them a bit, then we play the voice of our leader. Uh, let me see if I can be able to start it from here. Oh, George, what is here? <laughs> I don't saw M branch. <laughs> I saw M branch, the old version of M branch. M M one no. Let me see. What is Pamunak now? What is Pamunak now? Pony Pamunak. I'm not going to join on Jovi Con. I'm going to join on Jovi. I'm going to join Jovi. As you are watching it, you look as if they have action on that. Look as if they have action. They have all it takes to do, you know, something to start happening. They will not again when he face one man now. You may not. Now wow. IPOB. IPOB monarch custodian of what or culture and what? What is monarch? I think at the end, let me listen to them. At the end of the end, at the, at the end, let me see what they said. I, mean, I don't have time. I, my internet, I don't know what is internet. You know, today I'm not. Reach of love, peace of love, 
in the name of foreigner, priest or wizard, when the land of Jephra is him or her up as a final generation in the name of people of the Ajana. And may all abounding blessings be for all true freedom fighters of the Jephra freedom. In the name of people, we are Yama. Long live Jabra. Long live Martin and the Kano. Long live Martin Simon the Park. Long live. Go up there. Go up there. I have them to go on. In Guagawente. Just to tell you that, you know, I said I will have passed through this. Um, the stage of begin to you know exchange words with um charlatans, especially the chief in Finland. Um, after all said and done, I've discovered that that guy has nothing to offer. I've discovered that that guy just um is a small boy, he knows nothing educational wise, everything achievement. The only thing I would say he's big, he's um he have achieved a lot more than me is by propaganda and lies. That is the achievement he have done. Now maybe I can't compare him with the achievement. Lies, blackmailing. Now, uh, and I, I think um, the journey of this uh, guy has been handled to our women, and they are doing it very well. Our sister Chalugu is doing a good job on his, on them, on him. I think brother, mother, but you so uh, I can't at that stage. I got another level now. But just to recap, just to recap, the one never had the IPOB monarch. While we play, let's go to the voice of, of Mazen Nam the Khan. I think this contains um, how many minutes? How many minutes now? I don't know here. I don't know now. You can comment. No problem. I just open gate for, for all of you. I open today again, almost like 50. So that, um, you know, just release many of you from public toilet. So that in we can vomit here, you know, what you have. Uh, let's go. Let's go. Let's start it from here. pushing you to hold elections because they have something to gain from running a very corrupt regime here. I believe that some elements in America and in Britain especially are more interested in corrupt governments than in the welfare and well-being of ordinary people. That is why this very morning we are calling on, as my deputy will say to the phone, on all men and women of goodwill around the world. That in Africa, People want to do very well, but they don't have good people outside to support them. Mm -hmm. Only those prepared to do evil, to commit crime, to commit murder, to kill and to finish, only them have friends in Obama and in Cameroon. We know that some white people are conscientious. They have conscience. There is to do so without hassle. So does it mean also that you are now moving it into mosques in Ubrawasa, in Awasa Polari land? As you are moving back buses to churches, you are moving it also to maybe in Ibarosa, Ibadidi. Do you see why black people are monkeys and baboons? Do you see the way they do things? Do you see what they are doing? Two days to election, there are Permanent brother cards still outstanding. How do you intend to give it to people? How? This thing should have been done almost a year ago. It wasn't done. They're only doing it now. And they're moving it so that people will come. They know we are foolish. We go to Pentecostal churches and all these churches to give money to Rome, to give money to Canterbury, to give money to Yoruba people. Which church actually has its headquarters in Jaffaland? Do you know of any church with the headquarters in Jaffaland? In the international church. No, no. You tell us. 
Because I don't know. Because I know that Roman Catholicism is in Rome. Mm -hmm. If you go to the Roman Catholic Church and you contribute your money, it goes to Rome. Mm -hmm. Yes? And the Rome they have already. Huh? Mm -hmm. You know that the Bible says they will take from those that don't have and give to those that have. Yeah. Very clear. Every Sunday you go to church or maybe you go to block rose rock and kiss him. You contribute money, it goes to Rome. You're an Anglican. You contribute money or Methodist church and it goes to England That's or right. to Scotland as the case may be. Right. Baptist church, the same thing. Mm -hmm. Episcopal, it goes to America. Pentecostal church, it goes to Yoruba land. Which uh, people around the world who contribute money and sense to their father? <laughs> That's not. I'm asking you in the name of um, Jesus mm -hmm. or God. All of you, every Sunday or Saturday, you go and pay money in church. That money either goes to Europe, to America, or to Yoruba land. I am asking you again how many white people and Yoruba contribute money that they bring to their land? One hundred people. No. Now you understand, don't you? We know what we are doing. Believe you me, we do. Some people, can you answer it? That uh, you cannot. You will go to church, you will contribute money to Catholic Church, to Anglican, to Methodist, to Assemblies of God Church, to Ahmad Jehovah. You will go to Seventh day Adventist, everything you go to, to give the money on Sunday. Your contribution, your diet, yes, I agree, no problem. You are giving it to God, I also agree. But the God lives in Europe and in America and in Yoruba land, not in your land. I will ask you again, how many white people contribute money? How many Yorubas contribute money that comes back to the Afro land? To Yoruba land? The answer is zero. Now you know who the fool is. If you don't know what to do with your money, go and support Biafra. Use your money to support Biafra with it to buy weapons, with it to buy guns and ammunition. Correct. Correct. Use that money to support us. God will be happy with you. Because we are fighting for our freedom. We are fighting for our freedom. Mm -hmm. That is what heaven wants. You go and you pray. Jesus has come to set us free. Freedom, freedom. That's what we're fighting for. Bye. Maybe you don't understand it. Or perhaps this morning you will. By force, of course. They are moving. I need to have a stakeholders meeting in Enugu yesterday. We had a resident electoral commissioner, Professor Chukwe Mecca. Onokogo gave an account of the level of preparedness before Saturday's election. He said, we have so far distributed 1.2 million PVCs, those achieving 89%. We have 2,958 polling units and 3,361 voting points. We are fully set to go. How about the other people, the other 11% that not that they did not come to vote, but they don't have their PVCs. Is that not disenfranchisement? No, that's too much. It's too big word for black people to understand. It means you have deliberately excluded me from the process of voting, not by my own free will. Shambolic, if you ask me. Shambolic. We continue. They are now moving it into churches that the Holy Spirit can go inside the cards and vote for Buhari, maybe. In Germany and their monarchs. No, in Germany and their monarchs. But Germany is a republic. It's a republic. You don't have kings and queens in there. So where are these monarchs? Do you have oh, English language? Do you people know the meaning of monarch? Oh, Do you know the meaning of monarch? Oh my goodness me. Our leader, um, let's go. Uh, let us see what is monarch before we continue. <laughs> let's see. Let's see what monarch is. For many of you that are watching, let's see what is monarch. I know you may know it, but just uh, for the purpose of clarification, I don't know whether it's coming out clearly. Yes, it's coming out clearly. Uh, let us go gradually, gradually. You see, um, this is monarch. A monarch is a head of state for life or until abdication and therefore the head of a state of a monarch a monarch may exercise the highest authority and the power in the state so do you know who i hear now let me bring them again <laughs> let me bring them again this man we are seeing in other words they have authority and they could not do anything and the people are killing our nigerian government are killing our people why do they have the highest authority 
Look at it. He said, a monarch is the head of state for life. The only interesting part I want you to pay attention is that where he said, a monarch may exercise the highest authority and power in the state. But you know here now, God bless Samane, God bless Veggie Maria. In Jesus' name, I pray. These people know here now, they can't do anything. Even they are even urging barristers to go and speak with the babies. They are mobilizing babies to give them freedom. A monarch may exercise the highest authority and power in the state, or others may wield that power on behalf of the monarch. Usually, a monarch either personally inherit the lawful right to exercise the state's sovereign right, often referred to as the throne of the crown, throne or the crown, sorry. Like we have in 1960, between 1960 and 1963, Nigerian experienced monarchy system of government. But I'm in an Abiyafra land, and they are there, they could not do anything. Charlatans. Look at them here. Let me bring them as our leader is talking. I think it all okay, makes more sense to see their faces. Foolish people. Have you seen it? Not every father deserves to be respected. Look at here. Oma Oma Agunu Nyeweso. We will come have a point that many of you for years to go and we still you pull away. All this is just in Raya now. You try over 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 size this thing. Now let's continue. We say we don't want to insult our elders, but this one are not elders, please. You know elders, not this one. Foolish people. Is it not the same school that we went to that this one went to? But all the same. All the same. There is no monarch. Do you have vice chancellor, chancellor um, Angela Merkel? She's not a queen. So where did you go to go? Or you may try coming, you should have been working in the afternoon. After this, you're going to get work. Yeah, <laughs> Use this paper to beg, say, come out with coins. If you come back home now, you see me wear one big cap like that with you. I said, Now, uh, what you one as a as a one monster is bad. He's beggar, he's a beggar here. These are the things we want to destroy in our land, a lot of things to be destroyed in our land. Just like a program our brother Jonathan heard last time about burial. I've been talking about this thing, about burial. Normally, if somebody die in Igbo land, if somebody die, the person will be now spending more. And the thing has been in our brain. Don't worry, I don't want to digress. We are going to look into that when time comes. And they're here now. Yeah, we're monarchy, yeah. tell you that we are monkeys and baboons in a place to reason. What is a monarch? I ask you. We have defined you it. Know, you listen to the word. Now, somebody whose nickname is Pampas mm. doesn't know the name of it. If it sounds well, then you are outside. Monarch. And Allah, well, I will not meet some of you people again. I'm telling you. I hate ignorant people. I can't stand them. Because it's a disease. Mm -hmm. You know that disease you can cure with illness. You can never cure chronic ignorance. All right. Somebody went to school, traveled abroad, is doing, is sweeping the road in Germany to make money to to feed the family and send some money through Western Union home. I, I tell you. And you said you have monarch. I tell you. As if you know that I, I didn't know that he said something like this. <laughs> I say I know too here. Yeah. The one I am I'm I I can I, I, I confirm where he come from. The man is from Imo State. I know him very well. I don't know whether is it or Churros or one of his village. He's, he's a beggar here. Old man, especially when grandchildren get to the room. 
Hello, have you won't be all this will be to go be or apple on that to go. Yeah, 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 Monarch. Ibo Ibo and their monarchs Appreciate in Germany endorse Jonathan. Oh, monarch. You know, can I remember? You can't remember my son of a So that's what we're doing. If not for Chukwa, I wouldn't know you people. No, 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 no. I know you, our leader. Not us. I don't know what you're What for? Full of idiots. I do not know who you are. If you are making. You are in Germany. Where there are no kings and no prince, and they're doing very well. You are supposed to be a security guard. You are talking about monarch. Do you know the meaning of the word monarch? Hey, where define another man here? So, only an Andrew, how the monarch? Where will you Happy will be monarch. Very soon, I make that to my own. Happy will be. Which one will I I want a monarch now. No wonder other people are coming in with their those other ones say their own is Islam as Islam. Be careful, the monarch. No car, I know. No car, I have a car their own. No problem. Continue. Ignorant people. Many people in Germany and their monarchs have adopted President Goodluck Jonathan as their sole candidate for the weekend presidential election. In a statement, you know what the chairman. Is this council in diaspora, Mohammed Ben Dekazi? Is this council in diaspora, who is the traditional ruler of Ndibu in Germany? Is the Peter Godwins? Look at the name. He's a Igbo traditional ruler. Who is his name? Peter Godwins. I don't know. Sometimes I think I, I may have done something wrong in my previous life. That's why Chukwadam asked me to do this. His punishment. I must have committed a crime. I don't know. Again, well, again. That two part time is ready to punish me with this. <laughs> oh, well, I don't know. I don't know. I'm not going to punish you. Our leader, not only you. You are not only me. We, those of us that are trying to make sure I wake them up. If not because of the grace of Chukwu Gabba, I'm Ika Golang. This just is too much. One idiot somewhere in Finland will come out and say he wants to do state of the nation. Hmm. You're not a president of any organization, of any country. You are doing state of the nation. Then this one now is monarch. I won't know. I won't go one here. I want in here. Is what all of us committed. Hmm? Is a, this is a this is a this is is very very hard. This one is hard. I'm not gonna lie you, unless you are not into it. All the hard. Each way by, every, every, if you are packing this one, the other one will leak. We have destroyed the infiltrators in this problem. Before I know it, one idiotic moron, she from the same family, a tigra from the other side. Go and I and another one. Maybe after that one, who knows where? We will also have a leakage. But we continue. We are not going to relent. We are not going to relent. I don't know. Sometimes I think I, I may have done something wrong in my previous life. That's why Chukwuebem asked me to do this. I must have committed a crime. I don't know. That Chukwuebem is ready to punish me with this. I have done something wrong, and if so, I I ask for forgiveness. I also ask for forgiveness. I ask for forgiveness, Mara, from Nariaba, because this burden is killing me. Heaven knows I am sick, it is killing me. How can people this level of ignorance only maybe me see is driving me mad? You claim you're the traditional ruler of Igbo people, and you're not even asking an Igbo name. No, we were not brothers. Look at the a bit. With a seven days. A monarch, I'll go ahead in here from, from, from Facebook page. How? What he's talking is from phone. Amen, Allah. 
Ndijie. Kwe shi standu kuoku, kuoku ka madu. Kuoku. Onye ke jimana da adu sa chalatans. Ya, hongri morons. No, no, no. Idioti ke kwe shi video kwa adi. If you go to the house now, eh, give up. Pour a Four eke shows. I want to be up around. Even the, the person in charge of them is even the youngest. <laughs> the monarch. The monarch, all of them that are standing here, the youngest is the one that is leading. And that we are ready, mate. Idiot. The monarch, you cannot speak to your people. You now hear from, from phone. So, so if white man didn't produce food, you cannot talk like a man. Traditional prayers. Yeah. Ah, prayer. Pray. Ah, I've never heard this one. Say prayer for what? On Monday, the 15th of August, 2022, we will commence with a seven days traditional prayers. I didn't hear this one, though. He said they will commence for seven days prayer. So that our land will be free. Oh. In which we will call upon the Chukwu Bikalbiaman to use his Amadiyaman, the angel of war, destruction and justice. Among the... Come on, get out. Let me advise many of you that are watching. Never you depend on... Never you... Ne if you... Any of you that want to pray, pray in your house. There's no need to announce some people that you want to make prayer. Make can I leave this old method. These are the reason why we lose the war. We depend more on prayer, prayer, prayer. One God does not fight. Human beings fight. This old man are still doing prayer. I didn't hear this one. They said they are doing seven days prayer. For Amadion. Who tell you Samadion how to walk for seven days? These are deceits. You can use it to hold the gullible ones. Must you come out to tell people you want to pray? I was thinking that you want to say jazz now. I said, I don't know jazz. I hear saying that they do what about you shall go. Or they should. When I don't do anything now, I'm not allowed a seven days prayer. I mean, those things doesn't work. It does not work. These things are lies that we are going to change in this new generation. We only want many of you to be facing the reality. What, what you see, what you perceive that happens physical. Prayer is a lazy, idiotic, a coward. Prayer is, a, is an excuse for a coward. Instead of you to plan a way to defend yourself. You say, let, let me go and pray. Let, let us let us commit everything in the house of the Lord. Now lie. Yeah, no, no, give one phone. I'm sorry, no. Then me so. I am pushing him again. Then I am being angry. Without anything. We're gonna forget that thing, please. Anybody want to pray? This say you should not pray. Pray quietly in your room. Chineke or don't or or into Chile. No, no, no. You go get another. You are praying. Does he have the ear problem? So if you pray quietly within yourself, madogam. Even in this struggle, in this struggle, I feel ashamed. I say when the prayer department, but all these prayer department now, till now, what have they done? I could wear some 150 for 150 days. No, no, no. Una, una, una don't finish them. We need to change our half now. I cannot. Our leader has never come out. We need to change 150 days. Many of you don't know how that prayer came. Is also a deceit from these women. When they contacted this this uh, prophet in a, 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 a bumbling frosters, many of you are calling prophet. This one that say I, I carry power, power no be power that. Oh yeah, you know one fifty samuno God. Who let me charge the alpha? Look here, here, look here. Expected accomplishments of the Madonna within the seven days of our prayer include striking everyone who has had 
hand in the unjust and the continued detention of Mazin and the Kano. So, so for how many years now? Now, so, so had it been this is this works, you people will now wait so that the person that I'm um, committed or caused our leader to be in the hands of DSS will be living for how many years now? So now, now, now no so when I go come to prayer for thunder to strike the person. Thunder does not strike anybody. When it happened, it's a coincidence. There's a lot of people that have committed a lot. Even when the people who are innocent souls, especially those Fulani military, they have killed a lot of people. They, they have killed a lot of people that they can't, it's uncountable. But today they are living. Gowon is one of the examples of them. Gowon has massacred children. No, this one is not even adult. Gowon, Gowon slaughter people here and there. But today he's getting old, old and uh, he's enjoying his life. This is the reason why I want many of you to come out of this. Thing. Is, you see, these religious people, they are very wicked. I counter them. Do you know when they always come out online in the midnight? If you are awake in the midnight, around one o'clock, two o'clock in AM, that's when they always operate. Prophecy, prophecy. I counter to you today, man. I said, please, with all due respect, I want to engage you in a debate. Stop deceiving our people in a very calm way. I don't want to be rude. I said, you can't just, you know you are deceiving people. And you know you, you just want to wait so that in the midnight, here people will not be countering you. You say you are doing prophecy. These are things we need to chase away from our land. These are the reasons why we have a top a lot. Because of religion. Because of religion, why we have you do? Blind accusation. I think um, it's okay. It's okay. Let's continue with the horse of our leaders. Okay. Hey. Honestly, 
we are we don't have any shame. We continue. The common sense revolution, they are saying that the time have come for people to share faith in themselves that they need the conviction that the day will come when they will decide to vote and elect people that will take their country forward. And Guys, you just have to be able to ask any American you come about, you come in contact with. Do you have emirs in America? No. Do you have emirs in United Kingdom? No. Those in Germany, do you have other in Germany? The answer is no. Do you have uh, Sultan? The answer is no. Now, if you don't have all these institutions where you are, and I never had them, that is my argument against people for one Nigeria. I said to them, I never knew what a Sultan meant until the white man came. How did I know about Sultan and Emir? Because the white man said, I must stay in a country that contains the Sultan and an Emir. Let me stand. Do you want something for yourself? The answer is no. So why do you want it for me? Turkey is not a member of the EU. If you love Islam so much, why don't you allow Turkey to come in and be president of European Union? Simple question. Never difficult. Very simple question I ask. But you want me, a child of heaven, to program a descendant from the sun. The only people that answer Anya, the sun as their name. Light. You want us to be subjugated to darkness so that you can go and take crude oil. That's all. And we are saying no to that. I don't care or give a damn what you do with oil. All I want is my freedom. I don't want anybody to argue otherwise. Come and argue otherwise. We we'll continue. All right. Um, let's hold it here. Uh, our leader, let's hold it here. Um, we are going to we are going to move forward. Like many of you know, um, this is just to tell you that um, this struggle has been ordained to be working as planned. What we are encountering now is what has been envisaged that you will see. All this problem here and there is part of expectation that we are going to meet in this struggle, but we never knew the nature of the calamity. So um, these people you are seeing here, they don't mean well for us, but it's not their fault. It is hunger. I know you say Metisela, but why? Even if you say it's not their fault, but it's hunger. Me, I'm not, am I not hungry? You will not understand the mindset you have and others are not the same. It's not the same. So that is why you see them trying to walk in order to eat. Whatever I tell them to do, they will do it. Just when they hear that people are sending money abroad, they will just gather people and uh, knowing fully well that nobody is attacking them, even when they are walking against the struggle in the open, nothing happened to them. So they have no, they have no another choice other than to do what they, are, they were told to do and they will get their money. But they will not understand the implication of what I have done. Now they gave they have given seven days automatically. Seven days will come and go. That one will die off. They have collected the money to deceive other people. So that when we see it, hey, our elderly are even in support of autopilot, or even our elderly people at home. They never know that these are the charlatans paid. And every time they can they begin to answer monarch, happy be monarch in the Afra land. I knew could have been going you don't know what is monarch. European, almost all part of Europe. Before they were practicing monarchy system, until they went into revolution. Can they have a any monarch? So that in the morning, we will go and bow down to one idiot who calls himself a monarch. Now, um. Let's let's let me see. Let me see what I have here. Uh, is it what I have? Let me see it at home. Is it what I have? It's just me there. I'm a member of the Bible and Sadhana Zabatun. How? Why are we speaking English? 
the, the British take gone to each and every country around the world, the answer is no, they have BBC. Why is it that you have this almost um, a preponderance of American influence around the world? Is it not CNN? Did CNN not start this global 24 hour news before the BBC cut off? Is it not, are you not today talking about Al Jazeera and the Arab people? Is it not news? You know, the 2020 pounds they gave us conditioned our brain. The only thing we ascribe value to is money, not the other things that are more important than money. Media doesn't make any money, it runs on a loss. Or but I'm just single handedly paid off all the debt owed by AIP. I'm sure some of you know this. The Bank know what media is. That is why you come to Lagos, they call you a color, you're feeling ashamed. That is why if you don't live in Lagos, you feel inferior. Because they made Lagos, although they don't see, they give you the impression that Lagos is hip. Have you forgotten that today you have a shade? Today, when you seek asylum, you call it Haduro. You call your passport to Bali. All the Lagos words because it dominates your mind. Because you forgot the one important thing that you have to tell your own story. Or else somebody will tell it for you. My dear brother will tell you, our approach is quintessentially Biafran. You educate, you enlighten, you mobilize, and you confront your enemies. We told you, we enlighten you on radio Biafra, tell you things that you will never know, even if you like, go to Harvard and spend the next 1,000 years. Here we educate you, enlighten you. We mobilize you worldwide, as we said. Did we say that before? And then we go home and we come back. Have we helped with number? Very simple. Three steps. Educate and life in mobile. That's all around the world to demonstrate. Then you go home and meet the enemies head on. There is only two ways. There are only two ways. My grammar has to be correct. Only two ways to fight for your freedom. Only two. Not three, not four, not five. Either you go to the ballot and vote for the people that you want to see govern your lives, or you go to war. There is no sit at home. You do peace, you sit at home. Never. It has never worked in the history of humanity. The only way you can get the has never worked in the history of man. Sit at home. Uh, sit at home, sit at home. Uh, can't you see the, the governors are shaking now? Everybody is shaking. Uh, can't you see that uh, even the pastors now, everybody is now shaking? The governor that are shaking, Obi and now have shaky finish, then go to America and join himself. Uh, uh, everywhere is lock and key, lock down, lock down. <laughs> I tell him, look. <laughs> and the thing, the thing is very, very good to the coward, the cowardly, idiotic moron, I know the struggle. I know how to lock and key. Even my dinner day, those that are jobless. Since he said we should sit at home and find out something, and now I didn't go to shop. And I, I, then I, and I distribute her something. Also, we sit at home and they give me the freedom. I know I have replayed this in here before. I'm I'm a moon tickle again. Everywhere I sit at home, lock and key, sit at home. I go marker. This will show you that um, many of us have a long way to go. Those that are facing reality will know in their mind that these things they are doing will not get us there. Even the one we are doing alone, left off for it alone, is will be hard. That is why Master Lambda kind of want everybody. That's why he, he come down. Like that, so many people that have worked against this struggle in the open, if they leave them, it's painful, I know, because we are not equipped with armament we need to confront the system. Anything you are doing now, you are your own. Which armor do you have? Anybody, a, 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 a matured minded man, a very pure. Sincere, matured mind will know that these things sit at home can't give us Biafra. Economic sanction cannot give you Biafra. 
we need to come in unity. What is holding us is not outsider, if you must know. What is holding us is not outsider. What is holding us is inside. And that is why we devote our time to, to destroy any internal enemy we see. What is disturbing us is not external enemy. The major problem we have is internal. Because they are giving the external information on where we are, on how we operate. So that's the reason why we somebody will come at that time. Uh, uh, why are you every time you uh, let us uh, shake Nigeria instead of you? Uh, Simon uh, is talking about uh, shaking Nigeria, shaking from his bedroom. See how you listen. So if I every day I come here and I be lambasting Nigeria government. I will turn that fire you. You will die. You will this one. You will say, eh, hey, I'm, I'm doing a good job. You are not normal. You see what he said? He said, we enlighten you. Like many of them now that don't know the history of Biafra. They don't know about the amalgamation. They don't know how Nigeria came into existence. That many, many of them are the ones that are traveling for PVs. But you, even though it's hard, even though the, the situation we find ourselves now is hard, you you yourself you know what happened to us you know what happened to us you know the reason why ojuku decided to rescue his people you know the marginalization we are facing it's not that we are poor in our land it's not that we don't have natural resources maybe it's okay please oh, let us not divide let us hold on this tsunami if we live now we will suffer I don't just understand the, the 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 virus they injected in many of us. Normally, normally, people supposed to be begging us, begging us for unity. But you see, mo most of us are begging for that unity. Uh, we need one Nigeria now. One Nigeria, we move forward. We need one now. I begin to get confused. Are we the one that's supposed to beg for unity, or that's begging us for unity? So that's what he said here. Um, what he said, he said to educate. You see what I have here? Uh, let me make sure that is what I have. So, as I or demand, I need this is at home with the freedom. Enlighten you, enlighten we mobilize you worldwide, as they say. Let me say that before, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and then we go home. I'll come back. I'll be happy with number. Mm -hmm. Very simple three steps education, enlighten, mobilize people all around the world to demonstrate. Then you go home, you meet the enemies head on. There is only two ways. There are only two ways. My grammar has to be correct. Only two ways to fight for your freedom. That's a great fight, I guess. Only two. Not three, not four, not five. Either you go to the ballot and vote for the people that you want to see govern your lives, or you go to war. There is no sit at home. You do this, you sit at home. Never has never worked in the history of humanity. The only way you can get Biafra is to say, as our great brother said, one of the finest men who ever produced Bono Gitu, you know, know him, you will know he's a very intelligent man. Boycott all boycottables. War. Because if you go to vote, you can only get the same people, even if I vote you in with the best intentions in the world, you go to Abuja and they give you one more lamp to dance with you. Come up and start talking rubbish. The next morning, they give you your boyfriend when you go to the north. As a little bit of it, but they work with the day night. So you come up and start talking jazz the next morning. Regardless of who you are, because the system is inherently corrupt. The system is bad. Right. You can't change it. It's like a policeman stopping you at the checkpoint back in Biafra land and you're there shouting. Say, I, 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 I gotta go. You start to be American. I gotta go. You, I, you, you gotta meet me. You gotta meet me. Oh, You're making noise. That single checkpoint cannot change the policy from the East of the General Police. They are collecting money from him. Yeah. It can't change it. We educate, we enlighten you, we mobilize you on the 30th of May. I'm praying to Chukwu Abiyama and the spirit of the dead. Ask them to go and rest in peace. And then we meet our enemies head on. I'm going to do for things I don't know. What are you going to do? You ask yourself. Two things only you can do. In life, in life, everything is true. Everything is true. Talking and darkness and light. 
Is that correct? Everything is still hot and cold. Everything is still in light. See that you're blind or you can see. See that you can walk on your legs. Everything is still, everything is still in light. The same way, there are only two ways through which you can get your freedom. Anybody that is only two things you can do, one or two things or both of them to get your freedom. You know what that is? You volunteer to fight or you contribute your money. For sure. End of story. Oh, well, uh, end on here. Yeah. End on here. Do what he said. That is why I'm, I'm, I'm talking to those, especially, you know, I have a WhatsApp group. I'm going to begin to remove people. Um, I have to thank you people a lot for being part of that group. I will look into it as from tomorrow. Anybody that is not an, a registered admin member, I'll remove you from the group. Registered admin member, I'm going to meet it, especially those living in Western world. One that we don't want, um, I have to understand I come from, from outside. While you are in Biafra. Uh, then, as you can see, are, I'm supporting you people. We are, we are, we are supporting DOS. Uh, but I'm not a member of IPO. No, 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 we, we are not into that. We don't need anybody to support. What we are doing is a just cause. But we want to thank many of you for have seen light and condemn evil. Uh, but we are going to know who is who. This is, this is what he said. He said, either you volunteer yourself or you contribute. Finish. Two things. But we have somebody now who have added something. He's even collecting from people in the name of super chat. He's not volunteering himself on ground. He's not contributing anything. He's not contributing financial. What he said now. He said that I contribute your money, money or you volunteer yourself. As the case of volunteer forces or ESN. Two. So how are you going to be contributing financial? If not, if you didn't register. To be paying the necessary things they ask you to pay. That's what he said here. That's the only two. He said two. He didn't say three. I repeat before I, I, I leave it. I'm praying to Chukwara Biyama and the spirit of the dead. Ask them to go and rest in peace. And then we meet our enemies head on. I'm going to give you 14 now. What are you going to do? You ask yourself. Two things only you can do. In life, true. in life, everything is true. Mm -hmm. Everything is true. Open and make darkness and light. Is that correct? Yes. Everything is true. Hot and cold. Everything is still in light. True. See that you're blind or you can see. See that you can walk on your legs. Everything is true. Everything is still in light. The same way, there are only two ways through which you can get your freedom. Anybody that is only two things you can do, one or two things or both of them, to get your freedom. You know what that is? You volunteer to fight or you contribute your money. All right. All right. End of story. Oh, well, I'm happy idea. Yeah. Happy, happy, happy idea. Happy idea. Oh, we are all how we get this trouble done. Mostly for those in Western world. Because those at home now, we know your situation. And many of you that have been at home, we know your contribution towards this struggle from the beginning. So, those of you that are in Western world, I don't know what is your problem. Are you afraid of joining IPO meeting? I told you, son, where you are. I told, I not many of you to go to meeting or to register yourself with IPO. On the truck, I put here new cook every day. Uh, the last one I have here before. I have something that I'm looking for now. I have um, if you know you are watching me here and you have this uh, video of Asare Dokobo, please uh, send it to me. Send it to me in my WhatsApp. I have it here. I don't know. I'm looking for it. And I don't know where the thing just went. I have the picture, the, 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 the video of Asari Dokobo, um, where he's um where he recruited his um his a jaw a jaw hungry youth. You know, and I'm an asawana asawana now. Boko Haram Bena on your land on also. So who today can want asawana? Asawana asawana do wa wano there. Uh 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 only truck I am all war between us. We are all quite so bad there. At least, and we mutual respect. After it, and we mutual respect. And as much as um, he's being supported by Nigerian government, all these things he's doing, he's supported by Nigerian government. I wait, I wait for it. I wait for it. If I, if, if you know you have it, you can forward it to me uh, through WhatsApp. Let, let's go, let's go. I have other things before then. Now watch, watch this. When I tell you that the problem we have is not external, it's internal enemy. 
Watch what is going on here now. Um, which video plot uh, is which, which one are you talking about? Uh, which video? Ah, uh, yes, Paul Achebe sent me, I think, um, two videos. Which of the one are you referring to? I am looking for this one, like I said here. Let me play this for you. I know you have seen it. Look at what this white man is, is telling about you. In the, in the I know you have seen it, but let's go. There are still plenty of Nigerians who say that the Igos are much too clever for anybody's good. Well, now. That's really the reason they fought them during the war. Do you hear it? This one for those of you that are dying to become one Nigeria. Foolish people. There are still plenty of Nigerians who say that the Igos are much too clever for anybody's good. That's really the reason they fought them during the war, to teach them a lesson, to show them that they could neither expect to dominate Nigeria to nor to set lesson. up a country on their own. All right, to teach them a lesson. And you have taught us a lesson. We we'll have to confess. Brother, are we going to lie? You teach us a lesson now, not for you. Hmm? They taught us a very bad lesson. And up to now, we will not come out of it. There are still plenty of Nigerians who say that the Igbos are much too clever for anybody's good. That's really the reason they fought them during the war, to teach them a lesson, to show them that they could neither expect to dominate Nigeria nor set up a country on their own. There's a Nigerian joke that says that the very word Igbo stands for I before others. Hey, honey, so, do you see what, do you see the stereotype they have for you? Since I was born, I, I, I'm... I, I was just hearing this since, since I started this talk. I never know that people have even said I before others. In other words, this is the perception the white people have. And that's why they are using this word, we are dominating. You go to somebody's land, you walk your way in, you make money, you buy, you tell him that you want to buy his land. He, he gave the land to you. Then he now begins to see that you are dominating. And that's the perception the white people have because we are not speaking. We are busy now doing binary selling. So they begin, they show that narrative to white people. And that's why anytime we they see us, they say they are arrogant people. They want to, they want to dominate. In other words, we pin them down. The very word Evo stands for I before others. Certainly the Evos are competitive and aggressive. The nearest look around the market here tells you that. But these are the very qualities they need to recover from the war. No one who was in Biafra during the fighting can doubt the Igbo's ingenuity, their sheer ability to get things done. The Commissioner for Economic Development here says the Igbo's can't really expect to be like the Germans and Japanese, who emerge even more prosperous from the ashes of war. All the same, it can happen. It's already said that the Igbo's will reach their pre-war level of economic activity by the end of next year. So though they may be down, the Igbo's are definitely not out. It really depends on the help they get from the federal government, how quickly they're able to get back on their feet again. These public executions, there have been half a dozen so far, show the Nigerian army at its toughest. In fact, the Igbos are living under a military occupation. And though the soldiers are very much in evidence throughout the East Central State, their behavior has on the whole been good. After a few violent incidents at the end of the war, discipline has been tightened. The army has been of practical use in building bridges, so it could do more to help in the work of reconstruction. Perhaps the military's biggest contribution has been to put much. Leave out there, leave out there, brother. Uh, I'm, a, I'm a problem. We are in a very big mess. We are in a very big mess. The John is foul. Anybody that tell you that this is easy, uh huh. You know, Samuel, he are the one that uh, sold our leader. That's why Biafra have never come. Had he been, he didn't sell our leader now, but now Biafra have come. You a fool. You don't know what is holding what you are fighting. You don't know even the reason why you enter into this struggle. What we are even doing now is we, we don't even, even many of us don't understand what is going on. My brother, tell yourself the truth. Many of us, even me that is talking, I have never understand the scenario that is going around this Biafran struggle. You, you just conclude, um, why, they don't want us to be free. They don't want to, why? Why? No, why? Uh, because uh, they say we are we are we, we, we become the Japanese of Africa. Yes. And if we become the Japanese of Africa now, then uh, other other people will, will stop coming 
and be sucking our oil. We will now get hold of our, of our natural resources. Something, something, something is behind this. How, and they really deal with us. I, I have to die. I have to digress. Now, let me tell you what I have in mind about what is happening to us. They hold us in. We are like in a prison. We are like, we are like inside a prison with so many diseases. We are suffering from different diseases, but we are also not free. We are in a prison. Having also many diseases. They cage us with religion. Cage not even a knife court. It's not your fault. It is how they grew you up. They brought you up in that way. They, 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 you don't have the mindset and it, it's not something you learn it is inborn it's an inborn it's something they train you from childhood is is mentality they inculcate in you from childhood it is not in you what is in you is forgiven what is in you is hope what is in you is once that's life that's hope what is in you that this world is vanity one vanity what is in you is that let me pray for my enemy to repent what is in you is that I can't even fight for what belongs to me. Let peace reign. So, the, 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 as we are, we are down, they do so many things. I think um, network is really is disturbing. Uh, network is disturbing. I can see it. It's not easy. That's why when somebody come out and tell you, I know the day the Afra will come. Chai, you not begin to see people with drugs. You say it's true. No, it's true. He know it. This man, he, can, uh, he said, I want to go and buy fighter jets. How many fighter jets? Who is selling you fighter jets? What are you going to say? You are you buying it? Which which organization? Which country are you coming from? A, a sovereignty state. Which country are you buying the fighter jet from? If you got arms, maybe say, Mururu grenades, rockets. Maybe illegal, illegal acquirement of arms then we you see today's old fighter jet and people so can you not begin to see that our mentality is too low the mentality is down so even biafra is ready waiting for us biafra is very easy to get it's because of the mentality we have have never come to that direction that we can get this thing once and for all can you imagine that in this present condition you, you can find somebody from their community who is squatting Tinubu Akamara Jijiji like this. Akamara Jijiji. Let me know about Tinubu. You see somebody who is ready to embrace APC again. Hi. I know, I know. I, I wanted to show. I wanted to. My program is going somehow. And normally, and normally, normally. But I know. Brothers, watch, watch this now. Just watch this, watch this. No, 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 no. If, 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 if in fact, I, I don't even want us to get Biafra now. We are not ready. From our mentality, brothers, we are not ready. Let me, let me bring this in. Watch. Nothing day too much. Even crowd, Watch. Watch. Both home and abroad. Okay, stand up. Stand up. Stand up! The power. The power. power. I want a power. I saw Korea pin now. I saw Korea pin now. They put a touch in my own appeal now. A great year. A great enemies by. by What is going on? My, my internet is not, not. Ah, I want one of our. I want one. Do you know why I go into religion? I I come my group, but they don't want to speak. I know they follow one route now. It's not by force. Yeah. What is going on? What is going on? I want to. 
You have to hold on, brother. Ah, uh, hold on, hold on. Um, I don't know what is going on, but just hold on. Okay, okay. Now watch. Stand up, stand up. Power. Stand up. Stand up. Stand up. Stand up. How? It's not we that will complete this journey. Our, our children. When you bring us, when you bring us, oh, she from America, oh, she from America. The little you have is spending in the hotel. Eh? You will not again. They projected arrows in your body. And you use, oh, who brought you to them? Eh? Let the mother come. How many times have you come here? Yes, yes, you are right to You are coming for the first time. Here is the final box. Yes, network. Network is bad. Uh, network is bad. Here is um, somewhere else. But you know, I don't want to. I don't want to make it open. Italy that I'm reporting from the city of Vienna, but um, I know where I am. Um, Okay. I mean, uh, I'm say because other ones are playing. You must play. You must. You must play. Uh, we are trying to restore the connection. They say they are trying to restore my connection. My connection is is this is not Africa. Hmm? What are you trying to restore? What are you trying to restore? So you trying to restore my connection? Uh brothers, okay. Let's 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 take it from here while we wait. Impossible. We need is not is extremely impossible. The point here is that unity is strength. If we can come together because eventually, I don't see the nation. They talk deeply about it. Look at that nation from all angles. It's, it's, it's unfortunate, but I don't see us living together. So, what you are doing here, I appreciate very much. And Sabab is my name, Pablo Kachuku from Asia, and I'm from of Nigeria. I'm glad that you're doing this. And I hope this course will be taken to greater heights. Yes, sir. Because there's every need, every need for us to stand on our own. Thank you, brothers and sisters. Thank you very much. You take care. Thank you very, very much. Thank you very, very much. Thank you. Before before you continue, we must present this headline. And I compliment you. have had to say other things. We've not at all at all. We are going to be here for the next two and a half hours. Because here. Yeah. Thank you very much. Well spoken. Well, well spoken. It's a very fine addition to the family here. Things are happening in the northeast in Maryland to be precise. 
Um, somebody is asking me, I don't know, somebody said that from uh, one, is that correct? Um, I don't know. You have you to call those or match the rest of them? Let me go. And, you know, fight my own right. Thank you, Amazing. brothers and sisters. Well, anything having to do with people's, and I end this program prematurely. I'm having a very, a very, 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 I think it's from the application. The application. Uh, the application needs to be upgraded. They need to be upgraded. That's the reason why is um is not from my internet. My internet is working. That's why I am playing radio Biafra from internet. But um the app, the app is not really strong. It's coming together, dear friends, to fight for their cause is what I support with a finesse, with a finish. Um, their friend started years ago and in uh, 1967 it ran out to fruition when those thousands of people were slaughtered, massacred through program after program in Nigeria. Three and a half million Igbos altogether were wiped out in the struggle but what that oh, that brought the camels back was the king at the initial stage from 66 67 was the last straw that brought the camels back was to the war we got back to fight for our own right say make a juku well for the entire nation nigeria but they did not allow him, the forces, black, dark forces in Nigeria did not allow him to work for the good of the entire nation. They also wanted to nip him in the bud, the way they killed Johnson, Thomas, Omon Nakwe, Agoyelansi, and the rest of them. Some of you here are still young, you may not remember. But they wanted to kill Emeka Ojuku, the way they killed Johnson and the rest of the people. I'm not going to get into 1966. The entire nation, Emeka meant so well, you know, meant so well for the entire rest of the country, Nigeria. But the dark forces from the north, the forces that are still menacing, terrorizing the entire nation today, wanted to wipe them out. Some forces are now a conference. Yes, yes. So they wanted to tell so they want to kill me, my brothers. I'm sure they, you know, fight my own right. Hence, he came back and said, he was a great leader. Emeka was a great leader. Not Christic soul. He came back, he wasn't fighting for himself. He spent his mother, father's money well and spent his own money get his brothers together, his brother, you and me, and the entire rest of the Igbos, got us together. Since we cannot build Nigeria together, walk tirelessly, tirelessly build this nation because of some interest, let's build our own nation had in thousands. Yes, brothers. Um, I think I have to end this program now because the network is um, it's not network. Is um, this application I'm using? Uh, this app is very, very bad. It's very bad. I have to upgrade it before tomorrow. Um, it's very sad. Very sad that I, I will end this program prematurely. And um, let me see. Let me see what I will do uh, before tomorrow morning. I will come back tomorrow morning. Uh, to continue what I, uh, from where I stopped. I think I have to thank you, brother, for sending me the video that I needed. Uh, I don't know why. It's still rotating. I don't want to... It's a very, I may even lock this program because it's a very bad... Uh, it will be a very bad one. The network is not friendly. All what... I have tried to refresh.
I try to refresh. Mm -hmm. No, no, it's bad, it's bad, it's bad here. I want to thank many of you that are watching. I uh, thank you, brothers and sisters, who may have um, found your way here. I am very sorry I have to end the program prematurely uh, because um, the network is not really friendly with me tonight. I'm going to continue here tomorrow. We are going to continue tomorrow, but basically, I will upgrade this um, this application tonight and then see how it is. But tomorrow, I may come on just a normal Facebook. Um, yes, I will. I will. I will do that. I will do that. Yes, I will do that. Our brother Capuchino on CD. I will do that tonight. I will do that tonight, and I will have to update all of you. I want to thank you for those of you that have had time to come around. It's not easy. It's not easy. This gospel uh, we are preaching is for, for all of us to realize where we come from so that we can know where we're heading. Thank you, brothers, and remember, bless.